Tonight, a growing number of Republican senators are demanding to see the House ethics report into President-elect Trump's pick for attorney general. That's Matt Gates. The bipartisan House committee had been investigating Gates for allegations of sexual misconduct and illicit drug use. That investigation, though, ended this week when Gates abruptly resigned from Congress right after his nomination by Trump. House Speaker Mike Johnson said today that he will, quote, strongly request that the results of that probe not be released. I believe it is very important to maintain the House's tradition of not issuing ethics reports on people who are no longer members of Congress. I think it would open the Pandora's box. And there's also more fallout tonight for another Trump cabinet pick, and that is Robert F. Kennedy Jr. He's in for Health and Human Services Secretary. And Mr. Kennedy is a vaccine skeptic, and he is deeply suspicious of what many call the mainstream media. Illinois Senator Dick Durbin criticizing this appointment, this during an unrelated news conference today. Robert F. Kennedy Jr. may be qualified in some areas. He is totally unqualified for this job. He is engaged in quack science and crazy theories right and left and drawing a lot of attention because of it. I fear this man is going to bring those same ideas to the administration of this life and death agency, and that would be a disaster. And President-elect Trump is also filling out his communications team. He announced tonight that Caroline Levitt, who was his campaign's press secretary, will be his White House press secretary.